This is my room. Um, as you can tell, I love Twilight. Um, I've got Twilight birthday cards. I've got Barbies. Decorations. Um, I've even got a Bella quilt. And I got Breaking Dawn Part 1 pillowcase. That's cool. And as you all could see, I was actually, I was in basketball, I was in tumbling. So I was in softball. <clears throat> um, over here, as you can tell, is my patio. See? This over here is the woods. Can you all see it? And for my birthday, I got balloon <laughs> and flowers and a new green table. Let me see if I can get it so you all can see it. Hold on. There's the green chair. And let's see if I can get the green table. If not, then maybe next on the next video. Um over here is my living room and my kitchen, of course. Um you can tell all these cupboards here. And the beads. I did that for a reason. <laughs> um, and of course, I've got a poster of Twilight Break and Dawn Part 2. So you can tell I'm a Twilight Freak. So um, over here, I've also got calendars and all that fun junk. Um, let me tell you about my life. I have a, I've got two sisters. Um, I've got a wonderful three-year-old who I love. You can probably see him. Say hi, Jack. Say hi. <laughs> Um, I have a wonderful boyfriend that I really love a, a lot. He's always been there for me to support me. He's always been there to protect me. Um, I actually love hanging out with friends, spending time with my three-year-old. Um, Like I said, this is my bedroom with the empty wall with nothing on it. But, um, 
Yeah, like, like I said, I've got Twilight birthday cards, I've got cups, I've got everything that you can probably think of. Um, let me show you my bathroom. <laughs> this happens to be my bathroom. <laughs> I've got shower. This is my shower door. Is my sink. I you can all can see it. Probably not. Hold on. There we go. Sink. This is sink. Um. I've actually, let me tell you, I've actually did lose a very special person in my life that's been really hard on me and Jack. Um. I think about her, golly, 24-7, and um, she died from cancer, but the good part of it is she actually got to see me graduate and go to prom, and we um, actually went to Great America to go with the band, so that was pretty cool. Um, Over here is Jack's vest. Let me get in it. There you go. This is Jack's vest. Let me get it so you guys can see it. Ta da! See, he wears this when he goes out for do his job. It's called Canines for Christ Ministry. These are his cards, as you can all see, um, <laughs> and let me show you Jack. This is my little boy. He is three years old, and he has a daddy that I think is the great daddy in the world, and um, if you want me to, I can have him do some tricks. So hang on. Jack, speak. 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 Good boy. But anyway, let me show you all of his clothes. Yes, I know. Some people will say you've lost your mind. But, oh well. <laughs> this is one of his shirts. It's a rebel. <laughs> um, he's got about lots and lots and lots of clothes but he's also got about maybe two Halloween shirts so this one says happy Halloween with the pumpkin on it this one is called BOL which is called bark out loud and you know, he's got a lot of clothes, so I'm not going to show you all of them, but I will show you what he has. <laughs> but he does have a hoodie, which is a pullover, that does snap. See? Snap, snap. And then he can actually put it over his head. Now, last year for Halloween, I must say it for myself, he was... See? You can never go wrong with Spider Man. <laughs> See? That was his costume. 
and this was his last year costume. And because he was such a uh, Spider-Man freak, I got him. A Spider-Man candy bucket that actually goes with this uh, Spider-Man outfit. So be prepared to look out for Spider-Man, y'all. Um, let me see. Um, if y'all want to see my trophies, I'll be glad to show them to you. Okay, this one is my basketball trophy. I was in, actually in the Boys and Girls Club basketball team. And this was in 1996 to 1997. So we did pretty good. I actually had three of these trophies. So I think you all would like. But maybe next time in the, movie, in the video. Um, this is my tumbling uh, trophy that I think I like. <laughs> um, this is actually, I actually went to Joliet for this tumbling thing. So I think I did pretty good on that one. So, you know, um, If you ever want to do something, if you ever want to do something really special, you know, don't let your, don't let anybody tell you that you can't. And let me tell you why. Because first of all, it doesn't really matter what people think about what you're doing, but it has to be, you have to be proud of what you're doing for yourself. Um, you know, I just do it, I do tumbling or basketball just because I liked it. You know, no one told me how to do it. So, um, if you really want to do something, I would put put your mind to it, and then don't give up. You know. And for all your girls out there that really want something in a man, you can't have mine. But if you really want something in the good in a man. Don't give up. I mean, there's plenty of guys out there that would really, really, really would like to have some of you girls. Um, I know a lot of you girls or guys that, you know, are looking for a relationship. I didn't think I was going to get a guy. But I did. And I've been happy with him ever since. So, I thank you, and I hope that you enjoy it, and please leave a comment, so before I log off or say anything, I'll show you Jack one more time. <laughs> Hold on, let me get a good close to him, let me get a good close to him. And yes, he is a baseball fan. <laughs>
See? He's wearing an MVP. Whatever heck that stands supposed to stand for. <laughs> but when we were up, when we were living in um, Illinois, he was a uh, Cubs fan. So he's got a Cubs collar. Cubs collar. And a Cubs leash. Which I'll probably show you real quick. Cubs leash. <laughs> um, oh yeah, I forgot. One more thing before I go. Um My boyfriend would kill me if I forget about him. He actually made me a keychain of Jacob and Breaking Down Part 1. I'm not sure how he did it, but he made it for me. Um, I've also got this one. I don't know if y'all can see it. Hold on. I've also got this one. It's called... Bella, Edward, and Jacob. Well, this is actually in part two. As I can tell, you start thinking, my god, you have enough Twilight stuff. Um, here's a key picture of Edward. And again, this is from part two, I think. Part two? Okay. Um, let's and here is this blue thing, whatever they call this thing, is called Breaking Dawn Part 2. So, I know what you're all thinking, you think I've lost my barbells, but you know something, you can never go off Breaking Dawn Part 2. If you like romance, if you like fighting, if you like vampires, if you like werewolves, this movie is especially for you. Um, let's see. And, I think that's about it on this key thing here. Um, I actually don't think that, you know, you should, you should, you know, give up on anything that you are trying to do. Um, But I do think that, you know, if you don't think that you're not good enough, don't let people think, put you down. It's not, it's not worth it. Um, trust me. <laughs> um, but yeah, I, this is our first video, and I think that, I hope you guys liked it. And if you think my, my house was a little bit dirty and, and all that fun crap, sorry about that. Um, again, I thank you, and I'll see you probably next time. But again, this is my first video, and hope you enjoyed it. Talk to you guys later. Bye.